All right, welcome to RichardBankerWebDesign.com. Today we're looking at a component called Ohana, and we'll just be looking at how to do certain things within this program. We're not actually going to be looking at installing it or anything like that today. So in our administrator in Joomla 2.5, under Components, you'll find Ohana. You can click on it. And today we're going to be looking at just the categories, the venues, and the events, and how to go about setting that up. If you click on your categories, you'll see there's just one category there called uncategorized. If you have a bunch of different things, we'll, we'll make a sample category here. We'll call it my awesome events category. Kept safe for my awesome events. I will only put awesome events in there. You can also add a photo for that category and choose if you want it just to be a draft or if you want it to be published. We'll publish it right away so we can put an event in it. Now we go over to venues, same thing. We're going to want to set up all your venues. So to do that, very simple, same idea. So title, we're going to set this up as just the town, Gilbert Plains. And you can type in an address. Now, obviously, you'll have some sort of street address or something like that. Um, I'm just going to make one up. 110 Main Street, Gilbert Plains, there, and I'm just going to grab this address. They'll suggest addresses as you click on it and automatically put that in. So I'm not even sure where that is, but that's where it is. And you can add a photo if you want for your, your venue and hit Save. We've now added a new venue. Now into the meat and the potatoes, we're going to add an event. So we've got a demo event in there too. We're going to add a second demo event. You just enter your title. That could be anything you want. My awesome event 2. And we're going to put that in our awesome event category that we created before. You can select an event picture. You can add more photos to it. Uh, we'll add a description. And there will be cake. Yeah, bonus. Uh, the name of the venue. As you start typing, your venues will pop up. And it'll auto-populate with your event stuff. You can select a start date. I want to add an end time. Um, it's going to go over a weekend, I guess. Right now it's set up in... 24 hour time, but you can also change it in the settings. Is it a reoccurring event? Uh, no. If you say yes every, then you can choose how many months, weeks, days, or years. We're not going to make it reoccurring. Uh, you can also sell tickets. If you have your PayPal stuff set up, uh, cost per ticket, we're going to say it's $20. You can set up multiple currencies. Uh, we're going to limit the number of tickets to a hundred and we're only going to allow one ticket per registration. Uh, who can register? Everybody can register. You can set site members only or nobody and you can also close the registration dates on. Uh, we want it a week ahead of time. You can say it's published. The registration system you can uh, send it to a custom Pull that down. You can send it to a custom URL. So if you want it to go to your site, or if uh, you know you want to use the built-in one, then you can uh, choose your payment gateway that you set up. We'll choose it for PayPal. Now we're going to set save. 
and our event is done. So now when we go back to the home page, on the home page, and I click on my Ohana link, I have my two events. My latest one is my awesome event. And when I click on that, I've got the map set up here so you can see the map. Get directions. It's in awesome events. It's $20. And, you know, it's all set up, ready to go. Thank you.